Good day, wonderful family. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Thank you for always stopping by. In today's video, I want to share with us a very powerful spiritual bath that can help you remove negative energies, attract good energies. You know, when you have good energies, good things will start happening to your life. Prosperity will follow suit. Favor will follow suit. Open doors, whatever you lay your hands on will start prospering. Okay, but well, before I go into the video, if you're tuning in for the first time, you're highly welcome. Kindly hit the red subscribe button to make yourself a full member of this family. Like my videos, share my videos. And if you have been with me all this while, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate. May God continue to bless you in all you do. Yeah, this cleansing bath is very, very powerful. And by the grace of God, all the ingredients here is accessible no matter your location whether you're overseas whether you're in africa anywhere you are you must be able to assess all the ingredients by the special grace of god now this bath will help to remove negative aura from your environment if you're the type that nothing goes happen to your home to your family to yourself by the grace of god once you take your bath with this cleansing bath just once in a month, you begin to see changes in your life. But if you know you've not been doing cleansing, you are full of negative energies, you easily get angry, things are not moving well, a lot of negative vibes, there is no peace in your home, things are not moving at all. Please do this bath once in a week until you start seeing changes, then you cannot be doing it once in a month. Yes. But if you're used to doing cleansing, please make sure you do this bath once in a month. It's going to make things to begin to work more than how it used to work for you. Okay? If you're the type that get negative dreams, you see yourself losing properties in the dream, you see yourself returning back to the village, you see yourself eating snail or picking snails in the dream, you see yourself swimming in the dream, please don't, for, don't joke with this cleansing bath. Or... You've been doing well before, all of a sudden, everything got blocked. Nothing comes in your hand, nothing works again for you. No matter what you do, people will promise and fail you. You go for an interview, you will not succeed. By the grace of God, this part is going to help you a lot. If you're the type that is into business, you go to your shop, nothing is happening there. You sit down from morning to night, you will make sales. Believe you me, by the grace of God, you will see, after taking th this bath, you will see things will begin to work for your good. Okay? Now, the first ingredient for this spiritual powerful bath is our garlic. We all know how powerful garlic is in spiritualism. It's helped to remove negative vibes, negative arrow, negative energies, whatever that is hindering good things from happening to you or from coming your way. This garlic is, uh, is good to go for it okay another thing is our negro pepper i've made a video on this negro pepper we all know that this negro pepper is edible you can use it for people that have fibroid you can use it for it for people that uh, things are not moving well for people will promise you and fail you you sign a contract deal or a business deal the person will tell you okay i'll get back to you at the end of the day the person will disappoint you Please include it in your uh, cleansing bath. You will see how people will promise and they will fulfill their promise. Are you into business? People will ask you, how much do you sell your product? At the end of the day, they will say, I will get back to you. You will see them carrying exactly that bag or that clothes you're selling. They will buy it as an expense, uh, at an expensive rate, okay? But they won't buy from you. Please use this. It's going to help you. Then another one I have here is my lemon. You know, I made a video on lemon. So many people complain that they don't see that that's not the kind of lemon they have in their location. Okay, you can use any of them, even the yellow one. They're all good. Okay, use it for this cleansing part. The other one is bay leaf. This is my bay leaf. You can see I've been using mine. Then another, uh, the last one is scent leaf. For those that will ask me, can they use dry scent leaf? Yes, you can for this cleansing part. Then you can use basil leaf. I think that one is accessible for our brothers and sisters in Europe. 
or Asia in any part of the world. I think this one is common in Africa, but you can get the dry one anywhere you are in any African shop. So what you're going to do, how to prepare it. Sorry, I didn't tell us what this scent leaf does. Scent leaf is good to remove negative energy and it's helped to bring good things to our life. It's good for favor. It's good for prosperity. It helps to send evil forces and monetary spirit away from our lives. Likewise, lemon. You can use lemon to blind your enemies completely from seeing you. Okay? Bear leaf, we all know bear leaf is very good for attraction. It's very good to open our ways. It's very good for favor. Now, how you're going to do it? You're going to slice this lemon. You're going to boil it with the uh, cover. Even with the seed, just put it in the pot like that. Add your bear leaf. If you have broken bear leaf, this is an opportunity for you to use it. Then your scent leaf, you wash it, put a good number of feet inside the pot. Add your negro pepper, okay? Add your garlic. You can crush the garlic a little. You can even blend the negro pepper a little so that it will really infuse inside that water, okay? The lemon, you are not peeling the back. Just slice it. You can slice it into four or into eight pieces. Put it there, add enough water that will be enough for you to take a cleansing bath. Yes. When you finish, just sieve out the water. Allow it to cool down a little. When it cools down, just add a little salt, any kind of salt. If you have uh, sea salt, that will be perfect. Any salt you have, that is okay. Because if I say sea salt compost, really, so many people will tell me they don't have sea salt. So any kind of salt you have, just add a little to it. Then you pray, tell God the things you're believing him for. Are you believing him to remove all negative energies that is causing barrenness in your life, that is causing sickness in your life, that is causing setback, that is causing set a promise and fail, that is causing hatred, okay, that is making things not to work well for you? Is it causes, accessory causes, foundational causes, whatever that is hindering you from not prospering, from not progressing, from not getting to where your level or your mates are, for not being promoted in the office. These are things, these are negative things that is happening around us. You know the things you're believing in for. Say it before you take your bath. Pray inside the water. Tell God you want to, you want to prosper. You want to be fruitful in your finances, in childbearing, in anything you want. After saying it, you use that water to take your bath. No soap, no sponge. Just take your normal bath with soap and sponge. Then use this as a cleansing bath. Use it to bath from head to toe. For those that is on long hair, just bath the way you can cover yourself. Uh, you can bath from your face all over your body. If you're on low cut like me, pour it from your hair to your toe. By the grace of God, you must see changes in your life. It's a tested and trusted one. You can see I bought this one for my own spiritual cleansing. The lemon, you can use one lemon. You can use two lemons, okay? Depending on the quantity of water. For those that will ask me, can they do it for the entire family? Yes, you can boil it, let the whole family scoop from it and part with it. By the grace of God, you will see things will begin to work well for your family. Thank you for watching the video. I'll see you in my next video. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye.